One of the most significant media cases in U.S. history comes to an abrupt end. Fox News agrees to settle with Dominion Voting Systems, acknowledging it aired false claims about the 2020 election. Fox will pay a stunning $787.5 million to Dominion in the largest publicly known defamation settlement involving a U.S. media company. In a $1.6 billion defamation lawsuit, Dominion accused Fox of knowingly and repeatedly brought broadcasting false conspiracy theories that the voting machine company rigged the 2020 presidential election. John Fanolio joins us with more on this extraordinary case and the unprecedented settlement. John. Well, sure, Mikey, you said it right there. This is the largest publicly known defamation settlement. The case was set to start today. The jury was sworn in. Opening statements were about to begin. But at the last minute, the judge emerged saying both parties had reached an agreement. Fox News attorneys and executives left a Delaware courthouse without taking questions or making comments. But Dominion was ready to talk. The truth matters. Lies have consequences. Lawyers representing Dominion announcing that Fox had agreed to pay more than $787 million to end a defamation lawsuit Dominion had filed against the network. Fox has admitted to telling lies about Dominion that caused enormous damage to my company, our employees, and the customers that we serve. The case centered on Fox News's false on-air claims that Dominion Voting Systems rigged the 2020 election by flipping votes, despite privately acknowledging those claims to be untrue. Fox News had to settle this lawsuit because if it went to trial, it would have been an absolute train wreck for Fox News its reputation. Dominion initially sued Fox for $1.6 billion, accusing the network of spreading lies and conspiracy theories, the same falsehoods pushed by former President Trump and his supporters. Fox issuing a statement saying in part, we are pleased to have reached a settlement of our dispute with Dominion Voting Systems. We acknowledge the court's rulings, finding certain claims about Dominion to be false. How badly will it hurt Fox's checkbook? It certainly will leave a mark but they pay people like Tucker Carlson $35 million a year. They pay Sean Hannity $25 million a year. Laura Ingram makes $15 million a year. So Fox News has a lot of money to spend, but more importantly, they had too much to lose if this case went to trial and their stars had to testify that they knew what was being aired was a lie. The network's legal troubles aren't over yet. Fox is facing another lawsuit from voting technology company Smartmatic for $2.7 billion for similar allegations. Chair Micah, back to you. John, thank you.